November the 5th. What is painful will end. Isaiah 57 verse 16 writes, I will not contend forever, neither will I always wrath. For the spirit should fail before me and the souls which I have made. Our Heavenly Father seeks our instruction, writes Charles Spurgeon, not for our destruction. His contention with us has a kind of intention toward us. He will not always be in arms against us. We think the Lord is long in his chastisements. But that is because we are short in our patience. Interesting. His compassion endures forever. Psalm 118 verse 1. His love endures forever. But not his contention. The night may drag into its weary length along. But it must in the end give place to a cheerful day. As contention is only for a season, so the wrath of God that leads to it is only for a small moment, short moment. The Lord loves His chosen too well to be always angry with them. So the promise here is that the Lord will end the chiding. And we are called to bear up and be ready because he will tenderly attend to us in a fashion so delicate for it happens to hasten a happy future. He who smote you will heal you. His little wrath will be followed by great abundant mercies. Have mercy upon us, O God. Have mercy.